Today, I made a friend. I tried to make an atmosphere. It didn't work. And I got absolutely drenched. I'm done for today. Welcome back to the Rainerman. Today I'm heading over to watch Cray Valley Paper Mill against Canterbury City FC in the FA Fars. I watched Canterbury City's quarter final game against Biggles Wade where they come from behind 1 0 to win 2 1. So, to get a semi, I would have preferred an all Kent final, but an all Kent semi final is not bad because at least you know you're getting a Kent side in the final. Uh, I would be back in, well, I will be back in Canterbury City FC today. I'd rather them go through to the final than Cray Valley, but if Cray Valley do it, then fair play to them. Um, they're both in the same league of football. Cray Valley, I think, are the top end of the league. Quite high up where Canterbury are on more of a mid-table side, but in a cup game, that means nothing. And the ground itself, I think, holds only a thousand people. It has one stand. Uh, so I do hope they have a little bit of a terrace at the end of the pitch, so I can bang on the wall. Or, or this guy can, because this guy, this guy's loudmouth over here with his Biggles Wade family chant that famously, famously noted in the ground hopping video from before. But I'm going to go for this station is Canter uh, Cray Valley 2, Canterbury 3. Do you have a score prediction? 2-1 to Canterbury. 2-1 Canterbury, just like the big old wave one there. So, we'll see you at the ground. And, yeah, let's go. So we're at the ground and it's literally... It's safe to say the worst ground I think I've been to. I know they're in the eighth tier, but at the end of the day, I like it when a ground has at least a stand behind the goal, and that's what we have behind the goal. A bit of fencing and a port. <laughs> and then on the other side, you have a bit of scaffolding. You have got a stand like at there with like just chairs with a few seats and that and you have the same on the other side of the pitch but other than that it's not the same because the there's nothing to bang on like you can bang on you're not getting much sound out of that we're at all we're a bit confused on what size the home fan and what size the away fan so yeah so we just have to wait till kick off <laughs> and I guess we'll, let, we'll end up behind the opposition goalkeeper because I'll be back in Canterbury <laughs> Oh, other than that, it's cold. It's quite cold. It's windy. It's windy. And it hailed. It just hailed for like, hailed two, for like two seconds straight. And I was drenched for two seconds. Two seconds worth of hail. But, oh, we've got the Tom Eves of um, Canterbury here. So, you know, see if he can score from a corner. He's fucking used to Tom Eves. No. Oh, him, yeah. Fake East. <laughs> Fake East didn't do too great in the last game, but to be fair, I thought Biggles were a better side. Yeah, yeah but, somehow won. <laughs> yeah. That goal, though, the, the Canterbury's first goal against oh, Biggles yeah. that was mad. I can't believe I didn't catch that. It just came out of nowhere. But I suppose for non league, you sort of have to have your phone out the whole time because you know, it's pot shots against probably bad keepers. <laughs> Are you allowed to bring scooters into a football ground? Apparently you are. So, yeah, let's wait till this kicks off. Got about half an hour, so yeah, let's go. Bury it! No! Oh! Woo! This is it. Oh, go. oh, oh. Cider. Oh, the long runner. He's going the long runner. Here we go. Biggest yeah. test of your life. <laughs> <laughs> Is this a library? 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 Is
Oh, get the away goals in, come on. Get the away goals. Come on. Go to shoot! Oh! Go on! Oh! Oh! Go on! Oh! What? Oh, it's in, it's in, it's still in. Nice. Lovely. Go! Really? Bloody Millwall. Millwall's winning 2 0. Oh. Yo. This is a scrap, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> what is this? Oh, literally, there's no way to stand. I'm getting absolutely dressed. I've actually made a runner at half time. I wish Canterbury the best of luck in this game, but I am soaked and there's nowhere to stand. Like, there are two tiny little stands in this ground. Ah, oh, and it's just the worst weather. So, I'll do a little, little thing later on when I know a full time score. So I couldn't stay for the old game, but this is something else. Hail Stones, it's painful to stand in. The club, the club bar is full. I'm done for today. It's it. It's it. Yeah. It's a goal. Crave, yeah. Crave, Crave Valley take the lead. I don't know who scored. Duck says it, all it said was a four goal to give away from Canterbury City. But look at the weather now. It's actually a joke. I'm, I'm still drenched, but I wore the wrong sort of coat really. But the weather said it was supposed to be sunny all day. But they're 1 0 down, Canterbury. And yeah, it's a shame. I'm more disappointed about how sunny it is now. So I really do hope it starts raining because I feel like I made a bad decision leaving, but oh well. Full time and that game finished. 1 0 to Craig Valley. So I played to Craig Valley. Uh, it's, it's still worth play for in the second leg because it's still, yeah, it's still worth play for. There's only a, a goal in it. Uh, Canterbury will be trying to rack some goals up at home and hopefully not concede against Crow Valley at Salter's Lane on Saturday. Where I'll be at AFC Wimbledon because I'm top Jules. So, yeah, we'll see what happens in the other fixture. We will talk if you're right.